In the Eastern Conference, everything is topsy-turvy. All three division winners are already out of the playoffs. I never would have thought Montreal got this far. I didn't think they were going to challenge the Capitals in the first round series. And not only did they, they knocked them out. That's the President's Trophy winning Washington Capitals are already gone. So the Penguins and Canadians, this series is a lot like Rocky, the first one. Where Montreal is the underdog, the Pens are defending champ Apollo Creed, and like that first movie, the Pens are going to win, Apollo Creed's the winner, but Rocky, the Canadians, they're going to get a lot of respect in this one. I think it's going to go six games, but the edge has got to go to Pittsburgh and the defending champions, because I don't know how much magic Montreal has left. Finally, we've got the Philadelphia Flyers and the Boston Bruins. I really don't know what to make of this series. We're going to call it the Hot Tub Time Machine series of the second round. It could be great, it could be terrible. The only way you're going to find out is if you tune in and watch. I actually did see Hot Tub Time Machine, I thought it was a hysterical movie. And I'm hoping to see some awesome hockey from these two teams. There's a potential for some great goaltending, some good scoring games, some great defense, a lot of hitting, a lot of action. So I'm just hoping that these two teams all jump into the hot tub and take us back to the 70s for some big bad Bruins and Broad Street Bullies they can get it on. At the end of the day, I'm going to say Brian Boucher and the Flyers come out in seven.